Talk about a chilly reception. There they are arriving, the Miami Dolphins. Um, arriving in Kansas City this afternoon, greeted by single digit temperatures. For context, as Joe just told you, Miami, Florida right now is sitting in the mid 70s. So some of their fans were there to greet them as well. But Dolphins players ended up shouting, go home. It's cold. And some fans left to ponder what to do with their tickets as they'll face wind chills below zero for tomorrow night's kickoff. Fox Sports Dave DeMarco is live tonight with a suspiciously looking rather balmy Arrowhead Stadium behind him. Now, wait a minute now. What's going on here? Yeah, just still amazing. <laughs> yeah, no snow on the ground either. OK, show everybody this is just a giant photo display here at Union Station, and it's actually for some people with tickets that we met today as close as they're going to be getting to the stadium this weekend because of this weather. Jim Bullcock and a friend had tickets to see Saturday's wildcard matchup between the Chiefs and Dolphins. He was supposed to come up to the house today where we're going to go. So I called him and said, what time are you coming in? He said, I don't know. He said, I don't think I'm coming. It's going to be a little too cold. Now they're trying to sell them as ticket prices have reached as low as $36. It's brutal out there. It's going to be tough on the players. It's going to be really tough on the fans, but can't say he's got a lot of dedicated fans. It's part of what convinced Matthew Condi and his girlfriend to buy tickets this week. We found them searching for Chiefs cold weather attire today. I was hoping it would get a little colder. This is my first Chiefs game. Of course, not everyone likes the cold. This is definitely cold. We're more like us. Canadians. Yeah. <laughs> this father and son from Vancouver say Saturday at Arrowhead will be one of the coldest days of their lives. We got our Chiefs toques or beanies and uh, probably tried to pick up some hand warmers or a balaclava because that wind's ripping through right now. Yeah. <laughs> then you've got the fans from Florida who yelled to Dolphins coach Mike McDaniel as he arrived in Kansas City. Hey Mike, he wore a shirt in the summer training camp. I wish it were hotter. <laughs> well, it's not going to be hotter this weekend. But they're still here, even if some freezing Finns players apparently aren't sure that's a wise choice. By the way, that didn't appear to be Tyreek Hill that was shouting that there. Now, if you heard in the story there, the Canadian fans talking about looking for their Chiefs toques, wondering what a toque is. Well, it's one of these, a beanie. And if you're going to be at the real Arrowhead this weekend, highly advise that you wear one. Highly advise. And we're sure that wasn't Tyreek that yelled, it's cold, go home. <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah, we, we checked. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Dave DeMarco live at Union Station tonight. Thanks, Dave.